how can I sell AI automations to mid-sized and small businesses? Which industry is best to use? So this comes back to the question of 95% of implementation seem to be failing. So what is that 5% that is working? You have to start with any automation, with any kind of consultancy or advisory. You need to start with what is the business? You have to, don't go and chase an industry just because you think it's hot. Just because that industry is making money, if you don't have a background in that industry, you're not going to be able to make any impact. So you're asking what industry is best for me. What's best for me is going to be very different to what is best for you, Alexander. You need to start in whatever your industry is. So if you've been working in manufacturing for the last 10 years and the problems that companies in manufacturing have, go and help them. Go and help them work out how to fix those problems. That is the core fundamental of business. It's got nothing to do with AI. That's just business. We need to find the problems and solve them. Just going into a company and saying, hey, I'm going to do AI, that's insufficient. And that's probably why a lot of these uh, pilots are also failing, because you can't just throw AI at a problem and assume that it's going to get fixed. So first, within your particular niche, as somebody who has experience and contacts, etc., within a particular industry, you need to find out what those problems are that the industry have. And then which of those problems is AI? AI suitable for assisting with and it's not going to be all problems some of those problems can be solved with non-AI automations some of them can be solved with normal code some of them are human problems and they've got nothing to do with AI so AI is not always going to be the solution to the problem because it just isn't it's just another tool it's just another way to fix problems so how do I sell automations to mid and small and mid-sized businesses First, you find that problem, you solve it for a few people, either for free or for low cost. You build up a case studies, you build up a record of actually helping them either to increase revenue or to decrease costs. And then you go to other companies, but you have to solve that problem first and foremost. And that requires identifying what it is. So start within your own industry.